Alrighty, so we're here with the Alberta World Cup Academy's Heidi Widmer, who's had a great nationals. We're here in beautiful Whistler, BC, um, just wrapping up nationals at the final awards banquet. Heidi, you had a great race today. You were the second Canadian and uh, pretty darn good for someone who's known for sprinting. Uh, how'd the race go today? It went definitely better than I expected. Uh, the lead group that I was staying with, I knew were really strong skates here, so I was with Zina and Martina and Chiso Bayashi, and uh, yeah, really just kind of flattered to be skiing with them up at the front and trying to hang on as long as possible. Um, and the conditions stayed fairly firm, considering it was, I think, 18 to 20 degrees when we were out racing today, so they did an amazing job of keeping the course nice and firm. All right, and so you've had a really good nationals overall. It seems like you're in really good shape. Uh, let, you know, tell us how the how the week's gone. Yeah, I knew that I was uh, in good shape coming into nationals. I just wanted to finish the season really strong. Um, and in the past nationals, I've kind of dwindled by the end of the season. So my goal this year was just to be able to keep my shape um, up until the end of the season. And I'm more than happy with the way it turned out. Yeah, it was wicked weather all week, so that was like the cherry on top for sure. Right on, great. And so, uh, any big uh, spring plans coming up? Uh, beach time or, or uh, otherwise? Uh, yeah, I am super lucky. I kind of have like this triple threat April lined up. I'm doing some ski touring uh, in Whistler and Revelstoke at uh, Selkirk Mountain Experience for the first bit of April. And then my siblings and I are going down to El Salvador for the surf which I'm really stoked about. And then on the way back, we're playing a side trip to New Orleans. There's a jazz festival there and a couple like big headliners that I'm really looking forward to. And then back to training in May. So. Awesome, awesome. And uh, same plan for next, uh, next year, next summer? Uh... Yeah, I'm going to be staying with the Academy, providing that they have me back. <laughs> um, I am more than, yeah, I'm really happy with the situation I have in Canmore. I live with my brother Phil and have my coach Chris Jeffries uh, leading the charge for an awesome ladies team, so I'm really looking forward to what next season of training has to offer. Alrighty, thanks Heidi. Uh, yeah, good luck next season. I think it uh, looks like things ended on a great note this year, and I'm sure there's big things to come. Yeah, thank you. Alright, and you're welcome.